don't miss you. What up, YouTube Saws? I'm on my way to go do some business stuff. And you see the cars in the shop right now. I was literally like luckily five minutes away from the dealership when it happened. But hey, let me flip the camera on. I'm just driving. I don't know what happened or where it came from. But you can see that right there. That nail just came out of nowhere. But yeah, so we're about to see how long this takes. Hopefully I can still go do my thing for today and then get you guys this video. But we'll see what happens. Yeah, that, that one's Dunzo's. It's off the count. Oof, all right. So I got tire and wheel protection, so I'm about to go see what the dealer is, see if a different dealer is. Look at the rims, because this tire is flat as a freaking dog shit type so but. And she left the crib, which is one. That's amazing, mother. But uh, yeah, I'm just winning all these. And I'm about to Mom, she just brought these tires for me. Got my slicks in the bay. Got my car right there, about to put them on. Move the car there. And finally be able to go move them away. Ooh. All right. But yeah, there's the whip. About to get that tire on. And then move that, and then go get these things done for the day. You probably can't even see it, but yeah, let's get it. This is gonna be a decent video. It's one more video to add to all the collections I gotta add, but one more video to add. Damn, that doesn't look that bad for real, but it's bad, bro. I'll show y'all when it comes off. And I get an extra tire to burn off now. Free baby. Free baby. Shout out to the plug. What are you guys doing? What are you guys doing? Alright, so basically what I was saying, you also have in that last clip. Apparently the I don't even remember his name. He yelled at me for recording my own car in the service shop, which I mean I was standing outside, there's no signs to say. I could not record. And overall I was kinda of upset about that. Cause like it's my car, it's a seventy-five thousand dollar car. At the end of the day, I want to make sure everything's being done correct on it. was my first time to the dealership. Didn't know what was going on on the right side. Step away from the car. Your mouth it's just that bag right there. If you want to grab more, I can grab. Thank you. Um, oh, I mean, guys don't like to be videoed. Yeah, I, I just feel it work yeah, with. I get it. Yeah. I understand where you're coming from too. Yeah. But I'm not interfering with them. He's doing his work. Do you need a hand? you need to hand me your line and it up? Back up. Don't be calling me names either. So this is the tire that had the nail in it. You see right there, just literally poked right through. Dang. That's not even a nail. Huh. Yeah, that's not even a nail. 
Parachute. I don't know. That's really weird. I've never seen that poke through just like that. But they had me. I got the tire and wheel protection, so I got the radials on right now. I got this move. And yeah, probably gonna patch this up myself. And you know, just burn them off. Got an extra tire at home, thankfully. And we'll see how it goes. Alrighty, so just talked to the manager manager here. And he was a lot nicer than the service person I dealt with that completely like mouthed off to me pretty much, as you heard in the small last clip before I stopped recording. But when I get on the road, I'm gonna keep explaining what went through and all that. So yeah, huge shout out to Nathan. He's a service advisor there. He took care of me. He made sure everything was good with the car. He kept informing me what was going on. And overall, probably one of the best service advisors I've ever dealt with in a car, like a car dealership per se. So yeah, the manager of the service was just kind of rude to me at first he started easing up after a while once he realized like that i'm recording like this is what i do and that's gonna be a bad name or a good name whatever he does on me is how his business is gonna get reflected so yeah and then i talked to the uh, manager manager his name's fury at all db and he was really nice he told me yeah i could film there's nothing wrong with that and i mean i wouldn't review the dealership the best just because that one instant with that one person but other than that like solid dealership i recommend it. anyone need their car service like mopar whatever al db i'll let you know it's a good place service manager eh, kind of rude but as part of the game all that matters is they took care of my car talked to both the manager got his number he helped me out the service advisor was really nice and other than that yeah my car's back flat tire didn't stop me for too long tomorrow i'm about to go to the track so that'll be the next video getting uploaded and like, comment, subscribe, and I hope you guys liked it.